Good day and welcome to puzzle number 85. What number can be represented by the question mark? The numbers in the puzzles are as follows. In the first row, we have 3, 5 and 10. In the second row, we have 5, 6 and 9. And in the final row, we have a question mark 4 and 8. If you want to have a go at this puzzle, press the pause button now. But if you want to know the solution, keep watching. Welcome back to the solution of puzzle number 85. The numbers in the puzzles are 3, 5 and 10 in the first row, 5, 6 and 9 in the second row, and a question mark 4 and 8 in the final row. If you can solve this problem, well done because this is quite a tricky set of puzzle and here is the solution for those who have not solved it. So what we're going to do, we go look at the rows and column. It looks like we're going to work in terms of rows where the biggest number are on the right hand side. In fact, this is not true. You are going to work in terms of row, but this way, okay? From the right to the left. So what we're going to do, we're going to add 10 plus 5 that give us 15. And then we're going to take 10 minus 5 is 5. And then the last step we're going to do is that we're going to divide that number. 15 divided by 5 and that will give us 3. Similarly, in the second row, 9 plus 5 is again 15. 9 minus, no, sorry, 9, 9 plus 6 is 15. 9 minus 6 is going to be 3. And then we're going to divide at what we have done before. So 15 divided by 3 and that will give us 5. So similarly, in our last, row we have 8 and 4 so 8 plus 4 is going to be 12 8 minus 4 is going to be 4 and then we're going to divide 12 divided by 4 and the answer for the question mark is going to be equal to 3. I believe most of you will get it right because you guys are geniuses and I'll see you in the next one. Follow and subscribe for more puzzles. Cheers everyone and have a good weekend.